Let's go down the slide! Static electricity makes your hair stand up. What is static electricity? Static electricity is a weak electric current generated when objects rub against each other. For example, sometimes combing your hair can create static electricity. Does combing the hair create static electricity? I have an idea. Try using the small plastic comb! Not enough! I need more static electricity! <laughs> A big wooden comb! Huh? <laughs> Why is there no static electricity? <laughs> Quacky, not all materials can create static electricity. So what can we use to make static electricity? Let's go to the laboratory together and try it out. Practice your hands and brain. Let's create together. To, to the, the laboratory. laboratory. Let's, Let's go. go. We have prepared these items. A wooden stick A metal spoon A balloon A plastic ruler Let's give it a try! Rub the items against Quacky's hair and see what can create static electricity! The plastic ruler can easily create static electricity! The wooden stick does not easily create static electricity. The metal spoon does not easily create static electricity. The balloon can easily create static electricity. to generate static electricity when rubbing wood stick and metal spoon against the hair. It is easy to generate static electricity when rubbing the plastic ruler and balloon against the hair. You're right. Hey. Huh? Wow. Kiki, look, I have two big ears. That's the power of static electricity. Besides the balloons, static electricity can also attract other things. Let's do the experiment together. Yeah! We need these items. Coins. A plastic ruler. Metal clips. A towel. Small pieces of... Small foam balls. Let's try it together. Rub the ruler against the towel to create static electricity. Move the plastic ruler close to them and see. The small pieces of paper were attracted by the static electricity can't attract the metal clips. Static electricity can't attract the coins. The small foam balls were attracted by the static electricity. The pieces of paper and small foam balls were both attracted by static electricity. That's right. Static electricity can attract small items that are not charged. That's so interesting. Ah. I just got shocked. It hurts. 
Naughty static electricity! What? Static electricity is really mischievous! I like the lion hairstyle! But I don't like the static electricity when it hurts me! Kids, what do you think? It's an afro hairstyle! Choose a suitable comb! <laughs> Which item can generate static electricity? Which item can generate static electricity? Wow! Static electricity attracts the paper stores! Static electricity can attract paper scraps! Attract paper scraps and find out where the toy is! Yes! We found the car card! Which item can generate static electricity? Yeah! The paper men stood up! Static electricity can attract paper scraps! Attract paper scraps and find out where the toy is! Whoa! A kitten hairpin! She wants an afro hairstyle! Choose a suitable comb! <laughs> Static electricity can attract paper scraps! Attract paper scraps and find out where the toy is! Found the robot badge! Which item can generate static electricity? Which item can generate static electricity? Wow! Static electricity has lifted up the paper flowers! He wants a smooth hairstyle! Choose a suitable comb! He wants a smooth hairstyle! He wants a smooth hairstyle! <laughs> Which item can generate static electricity? Wow! The athlete lifted the barbell! She wants a smooth hairstyle! Choose a suitable comb! Static electricity can attract paper scraps! Attract paper scraps and find out where the toy is! Yay! A big red flower sticker! Kiki and Quacky are making beautiful grape bubble paintings! <gasps> ah! My bubbles are in the wrong places again! Got it! I can move the bubbles! The bubble is broken! How can I move the bubbles? <laughs> I have a good idea! Watch me! Wow! It's amazing! Is this a magic you learned, Kiki? I want to try it too! Kids, let's make a beautiful bubble painting with Quacky! what materials we need first. Plastic whiteboard and transparent bubble solution. A plastic ruler and a dry towel. Colorful bubble solution and a straw. Let's make it with Quacky. Pour the transparent bubble solution on the whiteboard. Which 
Which bubble painting do you want to make with Quacky? Hey, yeah, yeah. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Let's blow some bubbles! Quacky will blow the bubbles. Kids, you can help Quacky move the bubbles to the right places! To rub the ruler. The ruler is charged with static electricity. Help Quacky to attract the bubbles to the right places. Electricity will soon disappear, so we need to rub the ruler again to generate more static electricity! Keep moving! Static electricity can attract small and light objects! the bubbles. The beautiful bubble painting is done. All we need is plastic whiteboard, bubble solution, straw, plastic ruler, dry towel. Then you can make the bubbles move and make beautiful Bubble paintings! Try it with mom and dad! Picture book! Great big world! Read the picture book with Kiki and Quacky! Static electricity, go away! One day, Quacky was playing with his toys at home! Put the sticker in the corresponding position! Look! Quacky's hair puffed up, just like a little lion! At that moment, there was a knock at the door. Quacky reached out to open the door and... Crackle! Quacky felt like his hand was shocked by electricity. All tingly and numb. He thought to himself, it must be the naughty static electricity. But happily, the little kitten came to play with Quacky. She even brought him a gift, a balloon. As soon as Quacky got close, the balloon flew onto his little head. The kitten thought it was amazing, and Quacky said it was because of static electricity again. They were having fun playing when Mom brought in some delicious cookies. Quacky was all drooling, but Mom said they had to wash their hands before eating. In the bathroom, Quacky reached for the faucet. Crackle! He got shocked again. Quacky thought that static electricity was always causing trouble. It's so annoying. If only he could get rid of static electricity. Back in the room, Quacky asked Mom how to get rid of static electricity. Mom told Quacky that in a dry environment, it's easy to generate static electricity. We can put on some hand cream to make our hands moist, so that there would be less static electricity. After hearing Mom's advice, Quacky came up with a good idea. He brought in a humidifier. 
the humidifier can make the air moist. In this way, we can get rid of the naughty static electricity. Finish reading the picture book story. See you next time.